Good morning, it's Mary Ellen from the channel Mary Ellen After 60. And today I am going to show you how I style my hair. I've had several requests, I'm surprised, but I have. And I'm just gonna tell you what I do. But before I do, I want to mention something to you. The, the silk caps that I laughingly talk about have been a huge game changer. I washed my hair two days ago and I just took my cap off. I just did my skin care. And this is what it looks like every morning when I get up. Oh, the, what I want to tell you about the caps. This one has not stretched out at all. This one, this was the one that was a little less uh, expensive. I think it was $8.99. It stretched out a little. So I put a safety pin and brought it together. I probably took maybe about three quarters of an inch. And I'm just going to stitch it with a needle and thread and just to make it comfortable but it still has a lot of elastic but this one did stretch out mm -hmm. game changer for me I would have let my hair grow out if I wasn't wearing them I have them at my bedside table put it on when I'm getting ready to go to sleep and the minute I wake up I just pop it off my head so Jim doesn't laugh at me <laughs> in fact he he has a deviated septum so he always has to sleep with his back against me so the product I use after I wash my hair, I let it dry naturally, and this was recommended by Lady W, and it's called, I'll put it, I'll write it down, I can't see right now, and this is how much I've used, and I use about four drops just on the crown of my head and, and blow it dry, and it does give me volume and it stays. So that's what I do when I wash my hair. My favorite tool, I had two favorite tools of all time and one of them I'll link the video below I can't use it anymore because my hair is short but this is my second favorite and this is the Callista Tools um, Pro Grip Styler and I've had this almost well I got it three years ago last Christmas Jim had purchased it for me uh, one of my girlfriends I've known forever just said you have got to get it and I and I will put a video below of when how I used it with longer hair but I really kind of thought that I couldn't use this. So, but you can, but I can, and I'll show you how I use it. It's just so easy. I just, I should have brushed my hair. I hadn't even brushed my hair today. I just put it in. Even with my hair short, I have to kind of use this hand to hold it in. But it will, just really does a good job. And if I want my bangs down, I just go like this. But see how it just kind of goes around that barrel? And it could not be easier. So, you know, for me, that's just a smooth... A smooth easy hairstyle I want to show you something else that I purchased some time ago that I like equally as much I remember when I read the reviews of this it wasn't great um, but she loved it and like I said I've known her since brownies and I figured it was good so you press on this until the light comes on and I believe it goes from 325 to 395 and I usually it's I usually do mine at about 365. Another thing I really like about this is you cannot, even though it's on right now, it will not burn you. And I've had so many burns in my life. I, I'm not kidding you. It's terrible. So that's the first thing. And my other equally as favorite hair tool is one that has a removable head and it's by Callista also. And you turn it on just by pressing this button and it also goes from 325 to 395. It's so easy to take the head off. It locks right here and you just turn it around to where it doesn't lock. You remove it. You can remove it when it's hot or anyway I do and you can put on the medium size head. So I have small, medium, and large. So I'm just going to go ahead and put this one back on and let it heat up a little bit. It has slots you go in, it fits into and then you lock it and it's there. 
This one didn't have great reviews either, but I love it too. And I'll put down when I bought it underneath, right underneath here somewhere. Um, but I'm going to go ahead and let it heat up. Today I did my skincare. I put on mascara. I put on navy eyeliner in my upper waterline. Buxom full-on lip cream. And I can't remember the name of it. But I don't have anything on my face today. But I will a little bit later. This early in the morning right now. I have tried, I have tried the flat iron, and I'm just not good with it. I still use my thick flat iron to iron my plackets and my cuffs and the bottoms of my shirts, but I've kind of been working on it. So now it's heated, and I use mine at 365, and I'm just going to show you what kind of curl you can get from this. You don't even need another tool with it, I mean like a brush or anything. I just grab my hair like this. I have to stare at my screen because I don't have a mirror. And it is sunny today. And also, like if you brush it, use it as a brush, it will add some shine to your hair. And then I just go right here and I kind of put it like that and hold it back. And then I'll just go around here and it has got to be easy for me to do it. And that, that is the truth. I just have to have something that's easy and quick. And I would have been fine just brushing my hair today and not um, doing anything with it. Or really, I just put my fingers through my hair. But I'm just going to do this side and show you that the difference. I mean, it gives a lot of lift and a lot of fullness. And if I was going to wear my hair this way today, I have the Kenra Volume 25. I'm probably the only person who doesn't like the smell of this, but I do like how it works. And I just spray some on my hands and I go through it and I lift it and just style it with my hands. So it's not perfect, but it's good enough for me. And I just really wanted to share two items that were definitely working for me. Now I'm going to go put on some more makeup. The order that I put on makeup so often is mascara first. I put the navy eyeliner in my upper waterline. And a lot of times I'll put on my lipstick before I put on anything else. But those are the three items I have on today. So it is all good. You guys have a great day and I will see you in my next video. Thank you so much. And...